Hello everyone, it is Chelsea and Deanna, and we are bringing you episode three of the thrilling Ask D and C. We ask do, this or that. Ask this or that. But today we have a special guest. Drum roll, please. <laughs> Hello everybody, it's me, Santana. I felt awkward the whole time. Wait, I know, like, I know, because I didn't, I didn't talk about what I was going to say beforehand. Yes. No. Okay, so. Okay, we got asked lots of questions, um, and Santana's going to answer them with us as well. Okay, yay. Okay, number one. We're uh, only answering ten. I don't know how many. Okay. You, I see a lot of favorites. Yeah. Okay, we we got to well, keep it. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> At Jake M. Larson asked, who designs your ring gear? And how much input do you give regarding colors and styles? Okay, well, someone in Canada designs mine that, or, do, no, I design mine, but someone in Canada makes mine, and mine's 100% what I want. There you go. That's the easy answer. Okay, very nice. Um, DIY, I do it myself. I design it. Actually, I've had the same design for, like, 10 years at this point. But you design um, but it. But I do, yeah, and I make it myself. Um... My new gear is the first one that I had uh, no input really in the design, other than I wanted mesh and I wanted a bra top. I love it. <laughs> um, oh, it's so uh, good. Otherwise, my gear maker, she lives um, just outside of Tampa, and it was kind of her, her um, imagination and what the virtuoso would look like. It's Boom. beautiful. Yeah, and I just ask for whatever colors I want. It's so the best. Yeah. This really is the is. best Black. so far. We were in a tag yeah. match the other day, and um, I was fighting Deanna and Chelsea, and I just couldn't stop staring at Deanna. Your gear Sparkling. is amazing. Yeah, it is. Okay. So okay. nice. Thanks, guys. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Mm -hmm. um, okay, question two is from at Robbie Deese. We know Robbie Deese very well. He asked us, what is your favorite venue that you have wrestled in? Ever, mm -hmm. do you think? Chicago. Yeah, I guess ever. Okay. All in. Oh, <laughs> um, that's good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the Hammerstein Ballroom in New York City. Hall. Oh, that's a oh, good one. That's a great answer. Know, that's true. It's still not. Ride, it's so. still not my answer, but it's a good answer. That's a good answer, but only only Hammerstein because um, that was the first time my dad saw me wrestle. Oh, that's yeah. Nice. Oh, that's yeah, a good that's one really too. Good. Yeah. Well, in that case, Brandon City, Illinois. There are twenty people there, and my dad is one of them. <laughs> oh. so. Okay, name your favorite TV show. Hmm. My favorite TV show. Who asked? Oh yeah. Yeah, they neither, they neither At pray. Flair's Naya, but she asked what's your top three, but I'm not going to give top three. Just do your top one. <laughs> My favorite TV show ever or currently? What do you think she's asking? I'm going to say currently. Mayans, MC. Good one. Well, here's the thing. I only have one show at a time, and whatever show is my show at the moment, that's my favorite. So currently I'm watching Elementary. Um... And it is that Sherlock Holmes, a lot Ooh. of like, detective stuff, investigation, that. so. That's a very good, one. good one. Mine is Shooter. It's amazing. And that's all I'm going to say. It's so good. You can watch it on Netflix. Based off the movie Shooter. Shooter, yeah. All right. Uh, <laughs> uh, Mike from Connecticut asked at MS, uh, I don't know, sorry, Mike from Connecticut. <laughs> What's the story with... Uh, Deanna and Chelsea's t-shirt design oh, but like I think by now everyone knows the story is is that we like everybody just tried to get their shirt they out they personally quick. designed them <laughs> and they love them love them love the protractor design so we'll move on to oh. at I am Dylan Peschel um, I hope I said that right Dylan probably not Yeah. yeah. Oh, if nice. you had to eat just <laughs> one food or meal this is a great question <laughs> For the rest of your life, every single day. I laughed about this for minutes earlier. I had an asthma attack. For <laughs> breakfast, really lunch, did. and dinner, what would it be? Can I give your answer? No, because I'm going to change mine now. Uh, oh, but I know you. I oh. know you still know what I'm going to say, but. Um. <laughs> <laughs> we already discussed this, and uh, it, I would become a chicken nugget from my life. Yeah. <laughs> um. Well, I love brownies, but I don't think I could eat that breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So I'd say cereal. Ooh, oh, that's a good cereal. one. And I would pick popcorn. Oh, yeah. Popcorn. I change it from the toasted salad to popcorn. <laughs> um, okay, now we're right here. Oh, um, okay. At 12 underscore Nicholson asked, what is your favorite season? Oh. Of weather. Oh. I love Christmas. So I guess... But then, like, when I'm in Calgary and it's snowing, then I wish it was summer. 
But when I'm in Florida in the summer, I wish it was winter. So I don't have a, a favorite season. Oh. I don't like spring, okay? <laughs> I don't like spring. That's all. She doesn't have a favorite, but she definitely has yeah. a least favorite. I have a least favorite, which is spring. Okay. Um, Fall. Absolutely love the fall. Yeah. I just have this vision that, like, everywhere in the fall should be Massachusetts with yes. like orange leaves and apple picking and pumpkin picking and, and flannels and uh -huh. like, oh, that's just um, my dream that somewhere would be like that 24 seven. But I have yet to find a place. Yeah. Canada. It's a, definitely not it's Florida. Like a, that's for sure. No. Um, I yours? like all seasons. I don't discriminate. I, I like to actually experience and feel the, the changes, but in mm -hmm. Florida, I'm, I'm born and raised here, so we don't really get. Yeah. You're used half to just summer all year. Right. Room. But, All right. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna answer two more questions. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> okay. At uh, Bordeaux Taven asked okay. us, <laughs> "What would you like the NXT universe to know about you before making your TV debut?" Which this is a great question. Yeah, it is. Because the more we do this, um, the more we see similar questions. So I am going to challenge all of the people that ask us questions when we do these Q and A's to come up with something unique and that we have not answered before. Because like, as much as I want to tell you guys my favorite cheat meal, you guys can't hear that every single time. It's well, your burgers. Your, your dream it's appointment. Pizza. Yeah. It's beer. Your dream of yes. opponent. Yeah, 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 yeah. Why did you become a wrestler? The yeah. answer never changes. Yeah, exactly. So you can yeah. look at her, if you don't, if we don't answer your questions, and it's like kind of a general question, you could probably look back in episode one and two and get the answer. Yeah. But maybe not for Santana. <laughs> But you can look at tea time and get the answer. That is true. Um, okay, so I'm going to say, well, for all three of us, I would say I just wish, like, that people knew the journey to get to um, WWE and NXT. And not just, like, oh, they just, like, fought so hard. Like, no, everything that we had to do, all the places that we had to travel, the yeah. birthdays we had to miss, the, like, important things in our lives that we missed just to get, like, Twenty dollars mm -hmm. on the Indies, but like mm -hmm. to make a name a for ourselves. Of pickles, yeah, <laughs> a hot Times. dog, and a handshake. Yeah, that's yeah. what I wish people knew. Yeah, yeah, that's good, Chelsea. Thanks. That's mm -hmm. why I answered it for all three, wow. but like you guys can't answer. <laughs> <laughs> what What do you want people to know when you debut? Um, I I feel like that kind of ties into our characters anyway, like in a way. But I also feel like all the adversity that we currently face. Oh, that's a good one. And those struggles don't stop when you make the dream your reality. Like, that's true. Now, we all are still away from our family. We're still away from our friends. Like, we're sitting in a truck at a wrestling <laughs> show right now. Like, you know what I mean? Like those those adversities. We made it, girls. <laughs> oh, oh yes. <laughs> um, and you're still fighting all of those things that you fought on the indies to get there. Except now, you're there, and you thought they would stop, and they don't. Yeah. And you thought you like finished paying paying dues or or, or um, sacrificing or eating shit but you continue to do those things <gasps> I'm gonna so. have to beep that beep it just yeah. kidding I don't know how to beep it <laughs> <laughs> um okay last question yeah okay um well I don't know there's two and I'm trying to pick the best one Santana would you like to pick okay, one out of these two okay mm. well not that one because yeah let's see that one okay um at R B Coach Green, oh, are you related to Chelsea Green? Probably. Oh. Um, asked you only get one day at Disney. What are you all doing? Okay, well, first of all, I would book all my fast passes in advance, so I would do all the parts. <laughs> <laughs> so there's nothing I wouldn't do. So anyway, um, well, um, of all the theme parks, I love the Food and Wine Festival. Yes. Um, and um, I start in Mexico with what is that margarita yeah avocado, the avocado, avocado. avocado margarita so that's Ooh. a must i will do that all day i won't because i one time exorcism vomited all over and matt had to hold my hair back so i will not do that <laughs> I'll, I'll do it um i'll take my chances i think just because i've done all the parks so much that like i've i've done it all but i haven't been to star wars land yet is that what it's called galaxy's edge yes i had i know because matt always gets mad when i call it I'm star sure wars i'm sure you land. can borrow a lightsaber yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. And, um <laughs> i'd like to do that just because that's the one thing that i haven't done yet okay yeah. okay good answer okay yeah. guys stay tuned episode four you never know who's gonna join bye